Um, so I have just added um, a very cool um, padded band and you can see it's got a little bit of kind of netting on it there which I really love. So this is quite a, a trendy look um, at the moment headbands are having a real moment. Um, what's quite nice about it is that it obviously adds that pop of colour but it actually gives a bit of height as well and it's just so easy like you just get your hair done and then pop it on. Um, again it's on a headband so very easy to wear. Very easy which to I love. Wear. I love the big flower. Yeah. I think it's very fun. And actually as you turn your head you can't see this but um, it's very cool because the side of you like you get a beautiful face profile and then you get this gorgeous like pop of flower which is very very lovely mm. um, and it just finishes off this outfit beautifully doesn't it as a sort of the, the accessory to have so um, yes kind of ivory option mm. um, got a bit more kind of feathers. going on with the feathers but what's really key about this is that obviously ivory there's no ivory in my outfit but that doesn't mean to say that you can't wear something that is a different color to your outfit so it's quite nice to pull out colors in your outfits as you saw with the green hairband that looked really lovely but you don't have to stick to that and the, the important thing is is really to get the tone right and it has that lovely vintage kind of feel to it as well i think which is really nice and the beading Love the beading yes. on there, which adds a little Gorgeous. bit of glitz and glam. Quite tip for oh, yes. you on wearing hats. So this is quite um, a good one. Is that when you put it, place it on your head, two things. Um, make sure that the hat is actually covering your parting so that um, you basically only have one focal point when you've got the hat on. So what you don't want is if you've got, say like with Emma's um, hat, it's small enough, it could show her parting as well as the hat so she wants to place it on the side of her parting so that the hat is the only focus on her head also when you place a hat on your head a lot of people kind of go and place it like this and have it further back but as you can see it looks much much better if you bring it forward probably more forward than you might think and have it kind of at a jaunty angle kind of over your eyes and then it photographs better and it just looks much more stylish mm, as well particularly for you so yours is actually down onto your it's eyebrow mine. which um but i'm too low no i really <laughs> like that i really really like that um it's nice from the different angles i think when you see there yeah i think what it was that originally people were told to wear their hats back so people, the photographer could see the face um but actually i think it's now hats go on mo much more on an angle much more of an and angle, so you yeah. still see part of your face so and i think it just has much more of a uh, contemporary look and a bit mysterious yes. you know if you've got your hat on you kind of want the hat to be um, in it. the photo and then mm -hmm. once you've got your hat off then the photographer can take your face yeah. how amazing is that now if anybody's okay. going to um, Ascot or anywhere like that this is stunning so amazing. what I loved about it obviously was it's got a little bit of um, animal print but these feathers just add so much wow factor i think is the mm. word for it so my parting is this side so i'm gonna work but i'm gonna pop it on without the okay. label <laughs> i'm gonna pop it on this side so that you can see i'm gonna place it gorgeous low low onto my face and then yeah that has got some i love it and cool. because animal print is such a neutral even though you've got the floral dress yeah. on there it does work it has that sort of slightly kind of clutches. eccentric and fun and bohemian look doesn't it i like it mm. um and of course if you're quite petite then this would give you so much height yes. <laughs> that's the other thing to remember about along hats. with some heels <laughs> yeah if you you want to kind of if you're smaller then a hat with a bit of height will um give you that lift if you're taller then you probably want something less high with a bit more of a wide brim so what emma's mm. about to put on would be good make sure i get the right way around a taller hat <laughs> so this has got a hairband as well underneath it so which is very nice because it is so easy to put on now fleur which way that's right yes yeah. so that's slightly there we go yeah gorgeous so this is nice because it kind of it has this kind of a shape to it yeah, and I think that feels really glamorous. Yeah. And again, you don't have to wear navy blue just to wear this. You could wear any. Well, it goes yeah, again. Yeah, looks perfectly with this nice blue here. Um, yeah, no, I like that. And I've Oops. got a real statement here. <laughs> if you want a big, a big something on your head, this could be the one for oh you. Oh my gosh, that's fun. 
how fun is that now obviously that is massive <laughs> um, and i wouldn't put it with this dress necessarily no i would probably wear it with a dress that is um not hasn't got so much going on so if my dress is quite plain i think mm. you can go big 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 on the hat and make that the statement yes but i love that it's amazing well what's nice about it is the flower there. yeah which is beautiful so i think hats are going to be a big uh, big thing <laughs> <laughs> I'm just loving these hats. They're so fun. Uh, no, is my far enough forward? That's the question. No, this you is a teardrop to... shape, actually. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, that's beautiful. So, really lovely. Oh, I feel really excited. <laughs> I feel like I want a glass of champagne now. Definitely. So, 